Well, what's up everybody, it's Mr. Ball back at it. Just wanted to talk about an issue I've been having. Not a big issue, it's a small one. For one, I picked this up the other day. You might have seen the video on it. I love this fan. This fan I use literally every day in the house. Not only to blow on my back when I'm on the treadmill or to, you know, just go throughout the day when I want that extra breeze. Mainly, it's whenever I sleep. I'll put it right there at the edge of the bed. It blows up, and I love that sound. It reminds me of my grandma's house. This is low. That's high. If you watch the other videos I've made on this, you'll see I did a battery test for high and low, so check that out. I'll more than likely put a link in the description. But the issue I've been having, and others too, other people, it's not just me, whenever you leave it sitting there for a while, after about an hour or so, it slowly goes back. Overnight, that kind of gives you an idea how long the battery lasts, but overnight, when I wake up in the morning, it's like this. I don't like that. So, I heard that if you just take off these end caps, you can tighten it up and fix that. So let's see if that is the case. Let's see if I can even take that off. And uh, here's a toolkit, thanks to my insurance company. <laughs> So, uh, nothing fancy, but it's pretty cool. So I just pulled this thing right on out to uh, get to doing what we need to do. That goes right here. So let's see if we can just pop that right on out like they say. Yes, you can, and look, so simple. Nice. So if you have an issue of your fan just going back over time, pop off the end caps, Looks like you could just tighten it right on up. That was easy peasy. All right, let's see here. So we're gonna tighten it up just a little bit. We don't want to do it too much. This little toolkit comes in handy. Might have to do a little one minute chronicle on it just to show you guys what's in there. Guys and gals. All right, so let's just tighten it up and see. For one, it seems like it's already as tight as it can go. It did turn just a little bit. I can feel the difference though. All right, let's see. I don't, I can't, well, it seems like I can see the difference. Maybe I'm just thinking that. Let's see if we can do it. It's just a Phillips head that's there. Let's do it a little bit tighter. And a little bit tighter. There we go. Okay, so yeah, I could feel that. Yeah, I could, I could feel the difference. It's not a huge difference because obviously it's just a washer right there and the screw holding it. But it is a lot. It, even the screw moves when you turn it, so does the washer. So obviously, tightening it up with the uh, screw does do the job. And that's all you have right there. Let's just put that back in there. Let's see. There we go. That's it. Simple as that. And it is a lot tighter, so, so I know that that's going to do the job. So wait, why do you have these scissors? My dad got these little scissors so No cutting things. So. If you want to play with the little bitty baby scissors, okay. But no cutting anything sewing sewing kit scissors anyway I don't think I'm gonna have that problem let me let me push it back to test oh yeah look see before I could easily just push it and it would turn and it wouldn't lift this up now look it lifts it up so you actually got to hold this and push that to turn it I don't know how long that's gonna work or stay but at the end of the day you can always keep you know tighten it up it's not a big deal even it going back a little bit I didn't think was a big deal I was like who cares it doesn't start to really tilt back until after about an hour or so, and then by the end of the night it's completely back, so that sucks, but having to adjust it a couple times throughout the day is not a big deal. But now I don't think I'll have to adjust it at all. So anyway, I just wanted to talk about a, a fan and a small issue I had with this. So because of that small issue, uh, I'm going to give this a four and a half stars out of five. It was a five, but if it was like the light, the LED light is better because it does have a knob on the end that you can turn and make it real stiff to where you can't turn it at all or you can completely unturn it and it's just loose and of course you can get that in between so I wish they would have gave this a knob but you can't have everything right 
Anyway, thanks for watching the vid. Please like and subscribe, and uh, we'll see you all on the next one. See ya.